Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. And if you are new here, my name is Blanca and this is Mr. Little Man Zadriel. <laughs> Today this video is going to be about Zadriel and his first month of life and how it's been going and his basically yeah it's just an update to let you guys know how it's been this month if you are new here thank you so much for taking the time to watch my videos and to watch this video and i would greatly appreciate it if you comment like and subscribe and basically yeah to join my family and most importantly subscribe to keep up with every video that i post all right so Zadra turned one month on the 18th of this month of January. By the way, if you hear those noises, it's my dog. He's in his crate, like literally right next to me over there. But I have him in there because he is still adjusting to the baby. Like, he loves him. I know he loves him, but he's just a little rough. I wrote some stuff down so I can kind of remember because I don't want to be all over the place and talk way too much. So yeah, if you see me looking down, it's because I'm looking at that little paper right there because I'm going to try to remember everything. So yeah, we went to his one month appointment yesterday, which was the 22nd of January, Wednesday. And it went great actually. They said, um, well his doctor said that he is 11 pounds. He is a big, big boy, he said. But that it's good that he's a big boy. There's no worries there on being a little chunky. Right, my love? And he is 22 and a half inches long. He is a reflex baby. Um, I had honestly never gone through like none of this with my other kids. Um, with Zayden, Ziani, and Zayli. I wasn't really aware or informed of reflex like i just knew it would have to do with like spitting up somewhat but i wasn't really informed of it so yeah he is a reflex baby oh he got one shot only yesterday got a second dose of i'm not sure um, the hepatitis something i'm not sure but he got one shot and yeah that was pretty much it at the doctor but anyway now for his little um dislikes and likes uh, oh by the way he is in size um three month clothing this is a three month sleeper and as you can see he fits in it pretty well like he literally fits in it really good so he is in three months now um he was in nowhere for a little while but like i felt like it was becoming a little tight so i changed him to three months and he estaba like a little bit loose but i still put it on but now he fits in it great look not as loose so he isn't he wears still size one because i had a, like i think i i my sister-in-law gave me diapers of size one and then jesus bought a box and we had another box so i'm trying to get him to use all of those size one um diapers before but he's i think he's ready for a two <laughs> honestly he's such a big boy he is formula fed he is not breastfed anymore at all. He is formula fed, bottle fed, whatever you want to call it. He loves, loves the Dr. Brown bottles, but like not the wide nip, uh, nipple ones, but like the regular Dr. Brown. And honestly, those are my favorite, favorite bottles. I have them for all, well actually no. Dr. Brown's and Avon bottles are my favorite bottles, but since he doesn't like like the wide nipple i'm pretty sure he's not gonna like the avon bottles he's currently taking five ounces of formula every three hours basically he has like two good naps during the day and other than that he's up like he's not crying he's not whining well sometimes he is like kind of needy and stuff and he wants me to hold him comfort him you know and basically like um to feel me you know and that's okay with me yeah because i love holding my little man but um yeah he sometimes does need my comfort and i guess i can pretty much tell my smell like just feel me there but he's just up and staring like right now he's literally just up staring at me hates the car seat hates the car seat like if we go somewhere 
or like if we're at somebody's home like i'll be like okay are we leaving like right now because if i put him in the car seat oh my god we need to leave now because he will scream his head off so yeah i think it will get better over time sometimes like the other day i don't know where did we go i don't remember where we went but we went somewhere and I had him in the car and he was fine. Like he was really fine. But then all of a sudden, bam, he was like, nope, get me out of here. But big boy had to wait till we got home. He loves to look at his brothers and sister. I mean, his brothers and sister. He literally loves to stare at them. And especially when they're talking to him, he's just there staring. He does goo goo gaga, you know. He smiles. He has his nights and days kind of mixed up still. Sometimes at night, he will sleep from like, let's say 11 to like four in the morning, five in the morning. So at night, sometimes he does do really good actually. And then there's times where he just, no, mm -mm, he's not having it. He will wake up at like two hours, feed, and then sometimes go back to sleep, sometimes not. And then he, in that time that he'll stay awake, He'll just look at me and stare at me and like want me to hold him. Also loves to be worn. I bought this little, um, it's like a wrap thing that I put. He loves to be in that thing. He like loves it. Bautista. He loves to feel me and be on there. But baby boy has gotten so much more heavier that sometimes I have him on there for too long. He makes my back hurt. He does not like to be swaddled anymore. He likes to be free. Um, but he does like to be warm and cuddled Another thing is at night. He does need me to be there to go to sleep. So It's gonna be a little hectic one day if I'm not there at night <laughs> He'll grow out of it though. I think he will at least my other kids did He hates hats Like you know how usually when babies both these stop when um when babies are born, they like get, put them on a hat all the time. Even baby girls, but like you know how the girls have the big bows. Um, he hates having a hat on for the. Oh my god! For literally, he hates those things. I try to put them every time we go out. Like if we're at home, I don't put them on anymore because he just cries. So, but when we go out, obviously because it's cold, it's ugly outside. I literally try to put on a hat and that's another thing why I also took away the hats because like when we would go somewhere and he'll be in the back seat in his car seat, he will start screaming and I would ask my son, why is he screaming? Is he okay? He'll be like, his hat is in his face. He's crying. So I would tell my son, yes, um, can you please take it off? And then it was just kind of like too much. So <laughs> I was like, you know what? This hat's like, going bye-bye. So I took off the hats. I just make sure he's really covered really well in his car seat. But yeah, that's one. Oh, by the way, he did have a newborn shoe. So I will include some pictures here. Yeah, that's pretty much it, you guys, for his one month update. And, oh, here, I'll show you guys him. He also loves this thing by the way and thank you guys so much for watching this video and i hope you guys enjoy zadriel's one month update i will definitely keep updating you guys on my little man and like i said thank you guys so much for watching and i would really really appreciate it if you guys comment like and most importantly subscribe and <clears throat> how ziani always says hit that little bell so you're notified every single time that we post a new video and yeah, thank you guys. Love you.